I'm touching on you said a little bit that you're representing all of you, all the people in the towns. I've been very active going from town to towns. Uh, I've been up in uh, Sydney, Cooperstown, Coventry, uh, Ithaca. I've been to uh, quite a few towns in the last four years uh, discussing meetings uh, and, and moratoriums and meetings just like this one. And one of the things I find myself doing for the Joint Landowners Coalition, because I am pro-gas up there right now, is I've been given uh, petitions that were handed in the town by, by anti uh, people against the gas. And I, my job was to go through the petitions. I went through uh, uh, 22,000 signatures that were handed into Governor Cuomo. And out of that 22,000 signatures that were handed into him, 30% were from Africa, Nigeria, other countries. And this is this is not kidding. This is the truth. No, I, I, the town of Coventry, the town of Coventry, I went through their petition. They went through their petition, and they they compared it to the tax roll. They got handed in 2,200 signatures, and this is right on their website. And by the time they got done to go through the names, only 200 people from that town were on that petition. So you have to be very careful when you're handing a petition to make sure you, you match it against your tax roll. And the other thing that I found when I was going through petitions, that if there was a 15, 20 page petition, you'd find the same names on page one, three, seven, and nine. So you have to be very careful. I, and do your due diligence and realize that these petitions that you're getting, uh, uh, for instance, there was hand, one handed in the other night, I think it was in uh, uh, Carol, the town of Caroline, and they had a thousand signatures, or excuse me, the town of Vestal, they had a thousand signatures on it. And they said it was from everybody in the town. When I looked at the petition, they didn't lie. It was from everybody that lived in Vestal. But about 80% of them were college students that are there from New York City in the school. And it's easy to, it's easy to pad a petition, is what I'm trying to say. So just do your due diligence and, and look at these petitions that you're getting. That, that, that one petition, the 1,000 petition, was from a, a population of 29,000. 29,000 people in the town, they got, they, what is that, 1%? You know, 4%? Is that what it came to? 4% of the town signed on to put a ban in. So that's not representing the people who put a ban based on 4% of the people in the town. That's all that is. Okay,